Hey guys, today we're going to be playing Resident Evil 4 because this is actually being recorded in advance of Tuesday, October 2nd when Resident Evil 6 comes out. I'm going to be working the next three days, so I'm going to upload some Resident Evil 4 instead of just uploading nothing in that time frame. Uh, so yeah, let's get started. We're going to play on normal because I'm a little bitch who can't beat Resident Evil on hard. That's really hard for me. Let's go for normal. I've beaten this already. I I have a hell of a time with Resident Evil. 1998. I'll never forget it. It was the year when those grisly murders occurred in the Arklay Mountains. Soon after, the news was out to the whole world, revealing that it was the fault of a secret viral experiment conducted by the international pharmaceutical enterprise, Umbrella. The virus broke out in a nearby mountain community, Raccoon City and hit the peaceful little town with a devastating blow crippling its very foundation. Not taking any chances, the President of the United States ordered a contingency plan to sterilize Raccoon City. With the whole affair gone public, the United States government issued an indefinite suspension of business decree to Umbrella. Soon its stock prices crashed, and for all intents and purposes, Umbrella was finished. Dun dun dun. Everyone loves Resident Evil 4. Six years have passed since that horrendous incident. So Leon would be like 26 at this point. I received special training via a secret organization working under the direct control of the president. I was to assume the responsibility of protecting the new president's family. Oh, yeah. Why am I the one who always gets me short in the stick? Yo, who are you really? Come on and tell us. You are a long way from home, cowboy. You have my sympathies. Guess that's a local's way of breaking the ice. Anyway, you know what this is all about. My assignment is to search for the president's missing daughter. What? All by yourself? <laughs> I'm sure you boys didn't just tag along so we could sing Kumbaya together at some Boy Scout bonfire. Then again, maybe you did. <laughs> oh, you're crazy, American. It's a direct order from the chief himself. I tell you, it's no picnic. I'm counting on you guys. Okay, are we about to start gameplay? I don't want to talk over the cutscenes. Well, dialogue. I don't want to talk over dialogue. I feel okay with talking over empty space. It was right before I was to take on my duties of protecting the president's daughter when she was abducted. That's the ultimate reason I'm in this lonely and rural part of Europe. According to our intelligence, there's reliable information about a sighting of a girl that looks very similar to the president's daughter. Apparently, she's being withheld by some unidentified group of people. Who would have thought that my first job would have been a rescue mission? Ah, it's freezing. So cold all of a sudden. Ah, must be my imagination. Sorry it took so long. Okay, loading. We're loading. Now we're back in cutscene. Just up ahead is the village. I'll go and have a look around. Yeah, we'll stay and watch that car. Don't want to get any parking tickets. Right. Parking tickets. Good luck. Jeez, who are these guys? Did you say something? Leon, 
I hope you can hear me. I'm Ingrid Hunnigan. I'll be your support on this mission. Loud and clear. Somehow I thought you'd be a little older. So the subject's name's Ashley Graham, right? That's right. She's the daughter of the president. So try to behave yourself, okay? <laughs> Whoever this group is, they sure picked the wrong girl to kidnap. I'll try to find some more information on my end as well. Good. Talk to you later. Leon out. Alright, let's get going. I don't need to check out the file. Unless you want to see it. Which I'll, I'll just go into it for a second. How do I get files? And info on Ashley. Name Ashley Graham, 20. Daughter of the president. She was kidnapped by an unidentified group on her way home from her university. Kidnappers' motives are still unknown, although there's a reliable information that the perpetrator is an insider. Only a handful of people know about this kidnapping. It's been kept under wraps mostly due to the fact that we can't determine who the traitor is. I'm reading this really fast. The guys in intelligence say they have reliable information that Ashley's been sighted somewhere in Europe. But until we find out who the insider is, I don't know what to believe. It could be a ploy. We have very few leads as to the whereabouts of Ashley, but members of Secret Service and anyone else related to Ashley are being questioned by an investigative team. Even active agents are being investigated for any information. It's just a matter of time before the kidnapper is exposed. Alrighty. That was a lot of reading. My mouth is kind of dry now. I feel like I should get a drink of water. Or at least swallow. <laughs> that there's someone in there but yeah I I was I wanted to say this earlier but uh, I want to do the full game of this but this is just right now to tie it over until I get to playing Resident Evil 6 while well, recording Resident Evil 6 uh, excuse me sir I was wondering if you might recognize a girl in this photograph. Sorry to have bothered you. We don't speak English around here, boy. That's probably what he said. No, that's definitely what he said. They don't like Americans around here. I said freeze! Shoot him. Right in the face. Let's kick him. Are you done? He's not done. Now he's done. Dissolve into your gooey ash. Those guys are probably dead. There was a hostile local. I had no choice but to neutralize him. There are still others surrounding the area. Get out of there and head toward the village. Take whatever measures necessary to save the subject. Understood. Yeah, we blew his brains out. 800 gold. It's almost like Leon killed before. Oh no! They've got the door barred. Jump out the window. It's almost as if these people are infected with something. They're sick. Maybe they're some form of zombie. I'm good at headshots sometimes. Other times I'm just horribly aimed. None of you had anything for me? Whatever. I don't need anything anyway. What's in here? Handgun ammo. And box. Green herb. More handgun ammo. More gold. All of that is very good. And a save point. As you can see, I've played a good bit of this game before. There's my Ada story. And the one I have on Pro that I haven't really played very much of. Cause I tend to get my ass kicked. And I'm kind of scared to move on. 
I get my ass kicked in the main game in normal. There were some really frustrating parts in this game, I remember. Like the little the little midget Napoleon guy when he turned into a monster. Spoilers. I'm sure everyone here who's interested in Resident Evil 4 has probably played Resident Evil 4 by now. I've always wondered what happens if you don't help the dog, because it saves you later on. Oh, trap, 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 trap. Carefully, carefully, boom. Un hey, you gonna hit me? Ah, I was messing around too much. Got me stabbed. Faster, move, <laughs> aim faster, Liam. I'll take that handgun ammo, and we gotta... I don't need to look at the map. I don't need to do that either. I need to use the herb. Are there subtitles? I don't even remember. Screen settings? No, no. I don't need inverted aim. Okay, no. I guess there's not subtitles. That's crazy. I remember, I must have thought that the first time I played it, too. But it was crazy. It's always insane when they don't have subtitles. What about deaf people? Like me. I'm not actually deaf. I'm just using hyperbole. Smart words. Oh, I got you, too. <laughs> Fuck you. You done? He's done. What about you? Now you're done. Everyone just dropping handgun ammo like it's crazy. Like, I don't know what that means actually. I've just said whatever came to my mind like I always do in these videos. Okay. Hi there. If he'd made like a scary noise or something, that probably would have scared me. I jumped a little bit. Because I wasn't expecting him to just be there. Is there anything in there? No. Let's move on. Next area. Leon, how you holding up? Bad question, Honigan. Sorry to hear that. I'm sending you a playing manual. Hope you find it useful. I'll take a look at it. Thanks. Are we breaking the fourth wall here? Yep. If you find any reason to read this, you can. You're welcome to it. I already know the controls. Uh-oh. Here's where shit starts getting real. As I recall. Hello. Hey. You guys want to start fighting? Boom. Ah, no, I missed. Oh, no. Oh, I swear to God. You're not killing me. You're not killing me. I'm going to go in my... I'm not going to go... I'm not going to do that. I'm going to go out of the map, and I'm going to go into pause. And we're going to use this herb again. Oh, I, that barely healed me. Oh no, you fucking herb, you failed me. No, don't bring up the guide. I'm gonna use the first aid spray. Ah, oh, cow. Hi, cow. Protect me. Oh, I shot the cow's butt and nothing happened. Boom. Oh no, I missed. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Help! Ah, oh, no, I don't need a yellow herb. Yellow herbs do nothing without green. Everyone knows that. I always imagine that the, the herb health ups are actually weed. And they're just taking a lot of weed to heal in all these games. 
Capcom actually has a very pro weed agenda. No! Oh! All right, good. Stay. Oh, oh no! Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh! This is not going well. This is not going well. See what I mean when I get my ass kicked in this game? A red herb. I need a green herb. Some give me a green herb. I don't know how much of this I'm going to get through. If I die now, I'm just going to make it one video and I'll come back to it when I do a full playthrough. I need some kind of health. That is an angry mob if ever I've seen one. Boom. Stay down. Stay down for your own good. This is not going to end well for you guys. Boom, right in the head. Ah, you went flying. No, no! Ah! Does it checkpoint? Fuck, I have to do that whole thing over again? Well, I think this has been a good one big part video. So when we come back, I'll, f I'll continue the game, but I don't know when that'll be. I hope you enjoy. Thanks for watching.